champion for uh, 1978, 6 2, 6 3 over Wendy Turnbull. You had to expect a tougher match. Well, I, I really thought that I was going to have a tougher match, but I think today was the first time that I've played consistently well during the whole week, and I played a lot sturdier game. And uh, I found that I thought today if, if I just concentrated mainly on my serves, I thought that if the rest of my game fell away, at least I could rely on my serves. And uh, I was just very lucky, but my, my serves, first serves were going in most of the time. And, uh, and once I'm serving well, I find the rest of the game slowly gets better around that. But I, I really did expect a tougher game because um, she has played well in other matches and she has improved a great deal since, well, since I was playing in 76. So, um, you know, I think I surprised myself again. <laughs> What are your immediate plans now? Do you plan to go on to Houston and play? No, I have next week off, and then I'll be playing the next tournament in Los Angeles. And um, from there, there'll be a few, uh, another two tournaments, and I have two weeks off, and then it's three more. So it's, um, it can get a bit hectic, but I'm just glad that I've got this next week off because, you know, just playing indoors for a while, I've become a bit stiff in the rear end. <laughs> And uh, I need to settle down a bit before I start again. You told me the other day that you missed the birds outside. I noticed we had some birds in here this afternoon. Yes, that made me feel at home, actually. <laughs> they were here when I was practicing, practicing, so I was really hoping they'd stick around. Congratulations. I've enjoyed watching you perform this. Thank week. you very much, sir. Yvonne Gulagong, the new champion of the Virginia Swims of Florida, with a 6-2, 6-3 win over Wendy Turnbull. Bit of a surprise. Not much of a contest this afternoon, and that's the third time that... Uh, well, Yvonne Goolagong has beaten Wendy Turnbull, and Wendy has never defeated uh, Miss Goolagong, or Mrs. Colley, as she is now known, uh, since she was married last year. And it's the fifth consecutive singles win for Yvonne since coming back after she has had her baby. Of course, the others were outside, and uh, she just recently won the Australian uh, Singles Championship for Women. I'll be back with a recap of what's gone on so far and what we can look forward to for the rest of the afternoon. And this just uh, right up to this time out for Super A. Back at the Hollywood Sportatorium, as we've just mentioned, the uh, singles championship of the Virginia Slims of Florida goes this year, as it did last year to Chrissy Everett, goes this year to Yvonne Gulagong, the number two seed in the tournament, coming in seated second behind uh, Virginia Wade. And uh, Yvonne had a rough time getting used to the indoors uh, play earlier in the week, but she didn't show it today. She took Wendy Turnbull out. Uh, like a surgeon, 6-2 and 6-3, just sliced her up, got most of her first services in, kept her back deep in the court, and took away her quickness. The third-place championship went to Betty Stover over uh, Virginia Wade in a one-set match, 6-1. Both uh, Miss Stover and Miss Wade received $5,900. Uh, Miss Turnbull received a check for $10,000, and Miss, Mrs. Colley, or Miss Goolagong, as she is professionally known, received a check for twenty grand. So we now have the Bridgestone doubles championship coming up. This is played as part of uh, the Virginia Swims of Florida. Bridgestone is a tire company and uh, they are taking care of the prize money for the doubles teams. So Wendy Turnbull, who just lost in the singles finals to Virginia to uh, Yvonne Gulagong, uh, Wendy Turnbull will uh, team up with Rosemary Casals of Sausalito, California, and they will be going against Virginia Wade and Francois Dürer of Paris. Should be a good match. Two excellent doubles team and we'll be back shortly to report on uh, how that one is going. It's not going to start here for a little while. We'll be back uh, in just about an hour with a, an update on the doubles uh, championship. This is Rick Weaver from the Hollywood Sportatorium for Super Aid. Uh, in the final event of the afternoon, the Bridgestone Tires doubles championship between Wendy Turnbull and Rosie Casals. They are one team and Francois Dewar and Virginia Wade, the other team. Casals and Turnbull won the first set 6-2, but Dewar and Wade lead in the second set by a score of one game to none. $5,200 in prize money from the Bridgestone Tire Company as part of the Virginia Swims of Florida at stake in this event. That's how it's gone for the rest of the afternoon. The singles championship Virginia Slim's uh, Florida circuit, won by Yvonne Goolagong. It was no contest. She took out fellow Australian Wendy Turnbull in straight sets 6-2 and 6-3. That was worth $20,000 to Yvonne, $10,000 to Turnbull for finishing second. Third place 
A one set singles match that opened the afternoon's activities. Betty Stover of Holland defeated Virginia Wade 6 1, and third place was worth $5,900. I'll be back with more from the Virginia Slims of Florida in just a moment after this timeout for Super Aid. Okay, we're back. When next we join you, it will be the concluding interview and the announcement of the winners of the Bridgestone Tires Doubles Championship. As we have uh, a great deal of activity going on on the court at the present time, Casals and Turnbull, who won the first set of this doubles match by a score of 6-2 over uh, Wade and Dewar, trail in the second set one game to none. Turnbull has just served, Dewar playing up on the net, and Wade back in the backcourt as Wendy Turnbull springs for the set, slams across the return deep court, volley at the net, back to Virginia Wade, a loud shot over the head of Turnbull, she retrieves down the far sideline, and Wade slams the ball into the net, and that's the way it's been going. So Turnbull and Casals now have the advantage in the second set, trailing one game to none, they won the first set in the double 6-2, Ivan Gulagong, the singles champion, Betty Stover finished third, and we'll be back for our final report in just a little while. This is Rick Weaver from the Virginia Slims of Florida at the Hollywood Sportatorium for Super A.